Domain is all of the x values. to fill out. But more importantly, this is a test question. What is the domain and range? List the x's, list the y's. Okay, next one. Does anybody have a question about listing domain and range? Um, it's, so this one I think said domain and range. Here's where x exactly equals negative 3. Okay. 
So, um, remember, decreasing means downhill. So, starting with um, where x is negative 3, this starts to go downhill. So, down here is decreasing. This will be better if you could even see, like, a zero. Let's take a minute. Let's take a minute. So this is what I want to remind you. Positive means above the x-axis. We haven't talked about that in a long time. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go ahead and highlight above the x-axis. Okay. Up here, this red line is above the x-axis. So the red line is. You have a question? Yeah. Um, so guys, look. It's positive everywhere I highlight it. That's not. So it's not. It's not pertaining to negative three. Okay. This is decreasing. This is decreasing. Up here is positive. Down here is negative. Where is this red line positive? <laughs> so when I look at this red line for positive, I can see that it, it starts becoming positive. X equals negative 5. And it stops becoming positive at x equals negative 1. So it is positive everywhere in between negative 1 and negative 5. Was that an option? Um, no. Let me just tell you that. It's negative 4. Mm. Oh, it's this one. So it's positive within this range. When x is anything negative one and negative five, it's above the x-axis. It's about a start and a stop. Oh, It's going up here. All the way up here, okay? When is it increasing? When x is less than negative 3. It increases until x is negative 3, and then it decreases. Decreasing is the vertex decreasing. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. This type of question can be some of your easiest and most new questions because you don't need fractions, you don't need negatives. It's just increasing and decreasing. Wait, I wait. Okay. 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 And also, it's really funny when I really want to go, you get the point. Yes. Oh, Decreasing. 
if you put x greater than negative 3 and x less than negative 3, those are both marked up. Yeah, put that in your backpack.
and that negative 17 was the result. Okay? No! There was no more. I thought I had to do the four. Five times four minus seven. Twenty minus seven is thirteen. So I would say f of four is equal to thirteen. Oh my god, that means I put a four in and I got thirteen out. Alright, so let's see from the hand who thinks they're gonna get the test question tomorrow when the directions say you evaluate. Who thinks they're gonna get it totally right? U.S. households that order pet food online. All right, we're talking about A for Amazon. This is the percent of households that buy their, their pet food online, and it's X years after 2000. Explaining, explain the meeting. Shh, stop, stop, stop. Explain the meeting of A of 24 greater than A of 19. Most people would say that this is long. Most people would say this belongs on a big test, not a math test.
How'd you guys do? It's a Y intercept. And then you would move. In this case, it would be down three. So I'm starting at four. Down three, right one. Down three, right one. So on your fast line, you have to draw the straight line. Yeah. If I get two mingos and a yellow test and one spinner, do I get two flashes? No. I 
And I count rise over run. It's a one, two, over one, two, three, four, five. Good? Questions? We did a whole thing about finding X and Y intersect. How do you find the I need the pass. 
Let me scroll through and see how much I don't think I can show the work. I think I wait, that's how many copies you I should have shown the one problem. Please. I need to. Sorry. 
This function has a negative slope. It starts at negative 8 and it goes down. Now, if we fold across x, it's going to become a positive slope and a positive intercept. Actually, just I can never show it. Yeah, positive. Is that on here? along the x-axis, it would be a reflection. So now I'm going to do the new one. It starts at positive 8, and it goes up 2 over 1. It looks like up 1 over 1 because um, I went by 2. But can you, can you see that? Like that's a reflection? And the way I did that was just by distributing negative 1. inside the parentheses, it'll shift the line left and right. So this will shift it to the right. I will distribute. That's you. Stop asking questions at me like that, okay? Everyone be quiet. 